Coco. That was really hard. I mean, you were in the lead like the whole time, so it wasn't really. Good yeah. job. That was probably the hardest person to beat on our team. That looks really hard. I, I don't think I could have done. It. So Damien being eliminated is huge. I mean, I didn't expect to see him go home early against Neff, which is pretty shocking. I mean, Neff's my friend and all, but I don't know what that means for the team. And I'm just trying to keep this team strong to make it to finals. Uh, what happened? Uh, whoa. <laughs> Rip Damien. I just think it's funny because, like, everyone was just talking on call of how, like, he's been in the past five finals of the five seasons he's played and he's, like, never an early boo. And now he is. So, Nets sent him home. <laughs> General vibe that I'm getting when I get back at Damien because he's more of a competition guy, but um, I just got to feel things out and try to play my cards right at this point. I, it was it was really interesting to watch. I just don't think it was good. I would probably have quit if I was in that limb. I would not be able to do that at all. Yeah, same. I think we should send one of them into elimination now. Agreed. It's time to win. It's time to win. One of the beds is like broken and like it's just like the breeze is like flowing through. Go to the yellow room. Look how trashy that is. Let's go to the yellow room. Yeah, Let's go. Go. Let's go Trash the, the yellow room. room. Everyone is upset with Damien's departure, but he makes the final all the time, so I'm not really that upset. I'm just here to have a good time, and I'm hoping everyone else will join me. Guys, get out before they catch us. Oh my god. Get the Delete the stupid oh. garden. Guys, Nick, I'm on the roof. Help! Oh, nothing's here. <laughs> They're sleeping on the roof tonight. The yellow team is acting extra cocky, and it's time to take them down a peg and destroy their room. Oh my God! Wait, Brendan caught us. So we walk into our bedroom and see it's completely trashed by the other team, and I'm just kind of eye rolling at this point because they're so fucking gross about it. And I'm just thinking to myself, wow, you guys are really cool. Like, good job, I guess. We're still cuter than you, so it's totally fine. Okay, no, no to... go protect it. Go to our room and protect it. We need to build a fortress. Legit. We need to go to our room. Yeah, we need to go <laughs> break the yeah. doors off and build walls. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, <laughs> Dylan, are you actually doing <laughs> We're building a fortress. Do you have any blocks? Um, we can go get dirt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I broke the door. Let's go get blocks. All right. Okay, let's go. Let's get blocks. Do we want dirt or do we want, like... So Damien was just eliminated and we come back to the house so mad. We run up to the yellow team's bedroom and we decide to destroy it, totally rip it apart, because if they're gonna end up eliminating our team, eliminating our team one by one, <laughs> sorry, I don't know what to say from there. <laughs> one by oh, wait, there's one over here, come look. I know, but it's gonna take forever. Yeah, get that. But for now, I'm gonna use dirt until we get the wood. I'm mean, just like quick to get the wood. We only need four blocks. <gasps> Alright, go on in here. Oh my god, they caught this guy's run. Run. Oh. Quick! They better not get our room. I'll be so mad. <laughs> okay, literally, be, be, literally be more. Oh, we're chosen! Oh my god, one of them's in here. Get him, get him out. out! Get him out! Get him out! <laughs> go, go. Oh my god! One at a time. Oh my god, that was really scary. <laughs> oh thank god! Oh my god, we're gonna be seeing this. Let's take a nap, y'all. Oh, well, this shit. <laughs> Try and grab it. Try and grab it. Oh no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Can you fuck off? I'll keep it back. Dylan. Broke up. He broke our whole room. Like, what an asshole. Wait, that's sex, but we have no beds. Lol. I sleep on like these slats right here. 
Oh god, I'm just gonna sleep on the ground. It's fine. At this point in the game, we've been the dominant team so far. And honestly, the yellow team being petty and vandalizing our room just shows who the bigger people are. Us. Oh, my style. Block off their room so no one can get in without breaking blocks. <laughs> hey guys, I got a message from Marks on my carrier pigeon. <laughs> It says, <laughs> it's time to find out who has an eye for detail. Be a glow zombie and be ready for this gigarama. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I'm thinking that this challenge might be maybe noticing any, like, details on a certain room or mark or picture. And I don't have the best memory, so <laughs> this will be fun. That makes no sense. You're stupid. <laughs> it's gonna be one of the... It's gonna be spot the difference, I think. Yeah. Wow. Did someone say gagorama? Oh my, if it's that one where it's like, if it's like spot the differences, oh Jesus Christ, I'm gonna be so annoyed. I think we got it. First, I have a T-Mobile my Switch. Now I have a carrier pigeon. I had a black. Like, where's my Apple Watch? Come on. Oh, I have the Apple Watch. Do we I win the carrier pigeon? Yes, that's what we want from our challenge. I'll trade you my Apple Watch for your carrier pigeon. Guys, stop Yo. standing in front of me. Magenta walks in okay. doing the cha cha. The other team is like glaring at us. The vibes are great over at the Magenta team. Everyone is loving each other, and we decide to walk into the challenge doing the cha cha. I mean, it was just a lot of fun. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome to your fourth challenge here in the United Kingdom. We are getting right into it. Many of you think this is going to be spot the difference, but instead, we're going to have you guys decorate these obsidian rooms. Whoa. The next challenge is a building challenge, and, you know, I was a judge on Master Builder, so I'm thinking that I have a pretty good advantage here. Said bitch where? Said bitch where? This, this, this bedroom wars could have not come at a better time because you guys will be creating your new bedroom since you guys like to grief your old ones. <laughs> wow. Yes, that's oh. creative. So. Shut up, Derek. You are so stupid. Like, so <laughs> <laughs> go. When I say go, you guys will have 20 minutes to decorate your... Which yellow team member has ADD? It's Derek. The team that gets the the team that has the best room judged by me and DJ will win. So you guys We're building a bedroom or a room? A bedroom. Good luck and go. Mm -hmm. Like I said, and don't fuck it up. Be a bedroom? Yeah, yeah, it's supposed to be a bedroom. Yeah, like a bachelor bedroom. Should we make? Um, well, I could do the floors if you like. I could do. Like Remember, 20 minutes is not a lot of time, so, uh, take we a just need to Maxwell, take lead. Just start <laughs> I forced the leadership position onto Maxwell for a few reasons. One, I truly do believe that he had the best shot of leading us to victory in this challenge. But beyond that, there was a lot of strategy to it as well. The more people see him as a threat, the less they'll see me as a threat for later on in the game. I have the main idea for the room because I, I like building and generally people see me as a good builder. So uh, I chose a fun theme because yellow is very sunny and nothing else really works uh, for the sun room. And um, we do a quartz flooring with like uh, yellow sprinkled around the around the edges. Yeah. Okay. That could, yeah, that, that could work. work. Right, spread the floor with quartz. Um, and I don't, I don't know if I want to take up the entire room because it's really big. 
Uh, I agree. Uh, so, but we can just floor the quartz wall Oops. and uh, make it smaller later. Alright, so at this point I really have no idea what to do, but all I do know is that every time I do one of these building challenges, I always do the same pattern for the walls, and it always seems to go over well, so I guess that's probably what I'll do this time. So, even though the plan set out and Maxwell gave a good idea for the model, um, I'm looking at my team and they look like a bunch of chickens with their heads cut off, so I'm going to try to guide them in the right direction so we can try to get some progress going. Boom. Well, the- oh, is the sun in the yeah, because the sun's in the center, so if we shorten it, we have to re reorganize where the sun is. I'm okay uh, with doing it, but just like cut the room and then we could reorganize. Oh, it's yellow with... Oh, do they use a yellow glazed terracotta. Let's say like it's like a yellow and white, which is what oh. we're trying to go for. Oh, okay. Um, and try and make a pattern with it. I know it's a little hard to play with the glass, <laughs> but just, just run around in a circle until um, you get that. And remember, everything doesn't have to look perfect. It just has to be uh, detailed. I'm pretty confident everyone seems to be following what I said, and I believe in their building skills. And my, t uh, we're pretty good. We have a pretty good team of builders here, so I think it's going to turn out uh, perfect. It could, it could even win master builders because detailed stuff looks better than non-detailed stuff. They look like golden snitches. The truth will break your chains, we have the key Open your eyes and see We are the ones who know the answers And they ain't never gonna hold us back The sea is rising like we dancers oh, 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 oh. Imagine life without a bad day There's something wrong with these walls Yeah, well, uh, yeah, it won't be this isn't- okay, I kind of like- do you see the far wall over here, the one I'm working on? The um, far wall where? Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. Put, put um, black at the top, though. I think I that's do, right. I, I don't like, like the, the black. Uh, I think you should use some sort of white. Yeah. Um, can I change this to polished diorite so it doesn't blend in with the yellow? Yeah, but I, I really don't like the black. Can you change the black? Do like white or something? Wait, why are you doing that? What do you guys thing? think of the concrete powder in the middle? It kind of looks like dirt. They can try anything. We'll make it better together now. Don't be afraid of letting go. I know there's more we can be free. Open your eyes and see. Okay. Just just in case it has to have a door, you're gonna enter from. Uh, oh my God, how do I place? Doors? You think about the andesite instead of the terracotta. Hey, the, what are the walls gonna be made out of? Um, should we put a toilet in this bathroom? No, it doesn't matter. This is what? Oh, there is. Oh. <laughs> okay, it doesn't matter. Come on, what are the walls gonna be made out of? So the Magenta team decided to um, focus our entire bedroom around a bathroom because, I mean, who doesn't love the bathroom? I mean, I'm in the bathroom all the time, probably doing some things I'm not supposed to be doing. Okay, Mama. So, we decided to build a bathroom because we're thinking, you know, a master suite in every like a master suite has to have a nice big bathroom with it so you know we just have to include that in there yeah we 
I am super proud of our room, and I know for sure we're going to kick the other team's ass. When we were building the room, we thought we were doing something cute, but looking at it overall, oh, it just looks like a huge mess. Is that the bed is? Yeah. Alright, alright, we'll just watch what I'm doing. So as we were decorating, I thought that the potted plants didn't look really that good, so I, I tried to put cactuses in them, because um, I thought it looked nicer and it fit with the theme better, but... I was absolutely wrong. Doing one second, one second. Should we put like magenta banners as wall decoration? You see like something like that? Like put it... Three, four, five, six, seven... Guys, we're gonna have double beds because we're comfortable with each other, okay? Yeah. I've been sucking in these challenges lately, so being the leader in this challenge, there was a lot of pressure on me. I know I had to bring it, and I'm praying that we win this, because I could really be on the chopping block. Right, cut it off. Cut it off. No, here. just leave it. Just leave it. Okay. All right, Fly up and look. Like right here, I feel like should. Yeah, I right there. It looks kind of weird. And do that or something. Yeah, that looks fine. Oh, oh yeah, that looks fine. Oh my god. Um, that one's. Yeah, it looks it's fine. You guys fixed it. Good job. <laughs> All right, we're here in the magenta room. DJ, give us mm -hmm. your thoughts on this room. Okay, so, you know, in the beginning when I was watching them at first, um, I really didn't know anything that they were doing. Like, it was just looking like a complete mess. But I think that complete mess turned into pretty much a masterpiece. Um, it's very excited to use their, utilize their um, team color. Um, they did it in a very simple way. All I also right. like that they added like their shower and like their little bathroom and turned it into so more already, of a master bathroom. So I'm already getting this vibe that it's gonna be good cop, bad cop. All right, my first issue is the fact that they have a bathroom in their bedroom and that'd be great and all, except for it's completely exposed. So if I'm trying to take a poop right here, um, a, it doesn't really much look, look much like a toilet. B, it's like right next to whatever this thing is, like literally right next to it. And C, people can see you. And same with the shower. They were trying to use use this as like yeah, shower yeah. curtains, and I got it. But, I, I, mean, I get I it, but like it. also the toilet looks bad. And my biggest pet peeve right now, not only are the flower pots on the floor, but who the fuck thought to put cactuses and a sapling? These goddamn. <laughs> So, I found that that room was pretty tacky. As Mark finished judging our room, he looked very displeased. But it's time to see this room. Alright. Uh, Trivia, I'm pretty sure you know the server, just get on. Um, whoa! What? Well, DJ, I first love the fact that they have doors. 
the other team can't Yeah, wait. so they can actually get into their room. <laughs> um, um, I feel like this is a fucking literal masterpiece. I love the banners. This is definitely more intricate and the design. When they did black and yellow, at, they, the walls were originally, originally black and yellow, and I was like, wow, giving me some Bubble Bee Charlie Brown realness. But now they just look so beautiful. I love the chandelier. And then these banners are still my favorite, and I love everything about it. Now, what are your thoughts? Okay, so I hate the color yellow. Mm -hmm. um, I really despise you for making one of the team colors yellow. Um, but I'm not gonna let that dictate how I feel about this room, even though it's like yellow and I want to throw up. Um, I have OCD, so... Building off in the beginning when I came over here to look at them, it really like threw me off and I was about to like clock them and drag them just for like not being even. But they turned this into something that's like really symmetrical and I really like it. Um, I really like that they utilize their uh, team color well and it wasn't like overdone with like all yellow walls or anything like that. Um, I like how the design on the walls is a bit off. I think that makes the room a little bit more interesting. The floor is great. I like what they did with the beds and the courts in the corner. Um, the chandelier that they decided to add in because I felt like walls and like the ceiling were kind of lacking and I didn't understand what this was up here. Like just these wool block yeah. up there um but yeah i'm glad they like utilized it and turned it into something more and they actually did more originality style and creativity sure. all right so creatively who wins Ugh, i think yellow wins all right and Just with my opinion. with style um, I think that um, the magenta team definitely has a more aesthetic appealing. Like, if you had to choose a room to live in, that's what style means. So if you had to choose a room to live in, which room would you live in? The pink, uh, the magenta room. I agree. And now, originality. Which room is more, uh, uh, which room do you think went out of its way with the concepts and ideas. I think for sure. Sh I, I agree with like all of those. So do you think they should be crowned the winners? I feel like they should. I felt like they did a overall better job. Irrationally. <laughs> all right. So guest judge from the, the winner of Besties One Guest Judge DJ and I have decided um, it was a very tough decision, but ultimately one team had better concepts and the room looked more, um, stylish. So with that, um, congratulations to the yellow team. The yellow team, you have won this challenge. Are you kidding me? We deserve to win. I demand a recount. Uh Whoa. Flabbergasted! It really sucks to lose for a third time, especially since I was the reason that we lost. Whatever you say, our room was the best. We don't care. We're gonna go fucking have an orgy in our bed and go have a shower. <laughs> it's the whole season. We haven't been out to like piss or shower or anything. Hey everybody, Mark's here. I would just like to thank all of you guys who are watching for taking the time out of your day to support me. This project has been in the works for three months, and I'm so excited to finally share it with you guys. If you like it, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to vote for your favorite player in the poll below.